pressure of liquid is directly proportional to the depth of the liquid. The meaning is very simple. If we go to greater depth of liquid, pressure increases. And if we go to less depth of liquid, pressure decreases. And that's why pressure of liquid is directly proportional to the depth of the liquid. And this can be proved very easily. Look at this proof. We can take a cylinder, cylindrical vessel, and make three holes over it on its surface, but the size of the hole should be same. And when it is completely filled with water, and first close all the holes, and after filling completely it with water, then open all the holes. Then what is found? Let's say these are three holes A, B, and C. Then what is found? The pressure of water coming out of the hole C is greater than that of B and pressure at B is greater than A. It can be seen very clearly. That's why uh, we can conclude that C, the whole C lies at greater depth than A and B. B lies at greater depth than A and A is at least depth. This way, what can we see if depth is greater than pressure of water will be high? If depth is less, pressure of water will be less. And if depth of liquid is least, then pressure will also be very least. This way, experimentally, we can verify this. Easily, that pressure of liquid is directly proportional to the depth of the liquid. But I want to tell you one interesting matter. Look at this diagram. Water is taken in a vessel and there are two holes and water is coming out from each of the hole. Is it possible this hole lies at greater depth but pressure of water is less? But this hole lies at less depth. Look at the depth. This hole lies at less depth but pressure is high. Is it possible? I picked up this question from this book. Enjoy science and it is published by JK Education Center. If you want it, you can get it. Make a phone call to 4474191 or uh, this another number is also given 9841264268. at this mobile number. One of the interesting question is given here. What is written? A uh, container is sown in the same way and two holes are made. And from the lower hole, I mean to say the hole which lies at greater depth, water is coming out with less pressure. From the hole which is at less depth, water is coming out with uh, less pressure, uh, sorry, high pressure. Is it possible? The question is very simple here. The way with which water is coming out of the container is possible or not? And write down with reason. And one note is given in the given figure area of the hole is different and this is the key point area of the hole is different look at this here hole is big here this hole is small and pressure of liquid or solid or anything pressure is inversely proportional to area we know this because of greater area the pressure of the same liquid will be less because of less area pressure of the same liquid will be more. In one side, what can we say? The pressure of liquid is directly proportional to the depth. In which condition? These holes are of same size. If both the hole is of same size, then certainly pressure of the liquid is found to be more from this hole. But if the size of the hole is very high in comparison with this one, size of the hole is very high that's why pressure is inversely proportional to area so pressure may be less from this hole in comparison with this hole